those perfect pictures on Instagram and think to yourself, my goodness, that room looks gorgeous. I we're going to go behind the picture now. So, Leanne, we got you to post this beautiful picture yes, well, of this your is, bedroom. This is my master bedroom. I get asked two things all the time. Uh, well, I, I get told two things all the time. Number one, that I already, that I look a lot thinner or taller in person. Yes, Thank you. And too. then the numbers, the second question is, oh, your house must be beautiful. So that was a picture of my master bedroom. Yes. In my dreams. <laughs> Because I did post it as a giant Insta sham yesterday that that <laughs> actually isn't my bedroom at all. I set that up as a prop space to show how easy it is to have this sense of foolery in social media. Okay, let's and take a look create, at this actual space. So this is the actual, well, this is my actual, actual bedroom. Right. <laughs> Not at so all. When we talk, keep it real. So there's two bins of laundry down in the corner there with clean clothes that I've been sifting through my clean clothes for the last few weeks. That is my husband's <laughs> closet, which is the chair in the corner and my actual <laughs> nightstand has a roll of toilet paper that I use as Kleenex and, <laughs> and some lozenges and whatnot but I'll take you to my bedroom. Okay let's go see her bedroom, because, her Instagram bedroom. And really with this whole idea I wanted to show the concept that it's not just that not what every not everything you see isn't real. A lot of what you see is real and beautiful yeah. but it's often perfected for that photo op. Right. Right? Right. And I think the tougher thing is that oftentimes we judge ourselves against what we see online and we go, oh, that that room's so pretty. Why doesn't my bedroom look like that? Yes. Well, you know what? The bedroom doesn't look like that because my bed is actually a combination of bins and boxes <laughs> under here. There's nothing real about any of How this. How comfy. Right? The This was a one-hour shopping spree that I just picked up. Like, if you notice in the picture how I cropped it, I didn't like these two colors. So I just cropped that out to make it look like a separate custom pillow you start deconstructing it. this my ottoman is actually yes. on a paint can because it wasn't high enough See? in the shot to get the perfect angle yes so, so really move it and the wall paint wasn't even wall paint at all a piece of masonite board that I just painted out in oh the background so not to suggest that everyone should run out and fake their space yeah I think the reality is looking at these photos and I'm in the job of creating pr pretty spaces so this is a lot of how I live and I struggle with this but then you see my bedroom shots yeah. and we, we we have to really curate our space to be real. We don't always have fresh flowers on the nightstand and these ones aren't because they're fake too. Right. But it's not saying, oh, I, I aspire to be that person because that person probably doesn't exist. I love that lesson.